Yes, come in the middle. I hate to split you guys up since you guys are so cute. I hate. I hate that you guys are so cute. I hate to split you guys up. All right. It's all good. Are Our you sure? son has come between us. Want to see? Look, if you look at my phone. Oh. What has come between? Us? What has become? between you guys. Well, hello YouTube. If you didn't catch it, I'm here with Nappy Taps. So tonight, that routine that you guys choreographed just for this with uh, Travis Wall and a boa, and you just at the judges table. Oh my gosh. Tell me all about that routine and how hard was it to choreograph that with everyone? That was super challenging because, you know, logistically we had to, a lot of ground to cover. It would be like dancing from all, all the way across a football field. We had quick changes. We had to make sure that it was lit properly. Um, quick, you know, I mean, quick what changes were in eight seconds. Eight. And it, and for the people that didn't notice, it was all one shot. There's no edits, no anything. The quick changes were done magically in eight seconds, which is awesome. Almost and kudos to kudos to Marina uh, who handles the wardrobe and kudos to Bob who handles the lighting because lighting that entire route is amazing and kudos to James who does art direction for everything and it's a big team effort so you know we can't we definitely can't take all the credit there's some credit for a lot of other people but you know it's for us we thrive off of that we love that we love the one shot yes. love it so did you guys actually just do it one time or did you do it over and over we did it we, we did it takes. yeah we did it three times and the only reason that the other two didn't work was was a really small, minute um, uh, uh, lighting issue on Cat, when a shadow. Yeah, at the very, very end. And that was it. It, it. The rest of the times, it, it went really fairly well. You know, little mess ups here and there. But what you don't see behind the scenes is these dancers doing their scene and then running to the next scene and then throwing off clothes and changing. I mean, it's a madhouse getting, you know, people, there's people pushing things behind it. You don't notice or pushing things. And it's a, it was a really big undertaking to, to do that. Okay, you guys made dancing sound so fun, but so challenging at the same time. <laughs> like the reasons why I won't be a good dancer, but before you go season 10 finale and they announced season 11. Are you awesome. Excited? Are you excited? Great awesome. News. Great news because that means one more year of awesome dancing and, and it means another year of dancing on television. television. That's what it means. I mean, for people to still be tuning in, who knew that this show, this little show called So You Think You Can Dance, you know, with that corny name, come on now, who whoever thought of that name? When when I first heard it, I was like, Who's gonna watch that? That don't even sound interesting. Who's gonna choreograph that show? And then, and then all of a are. sudden, here we are, eleven years later. Come on, who knew? Do you know I started watching that show and I was three? That's horrible. That's not horrible. I was 11 when it started. I know. Only 21 now. Yes, I know. Only 21. I prematurely have gray. Only 19, only 21, only 13, guys. <laughs> Nappy it's a young world. It's a young world, guys. Nappy Taps, it was so good to see you guys as you always. always. Tell baby Linda and I said hi. Well, bye bye. Good to see you. Good to see you.